things we do, the things we do. Hello everyone and welcome to the Taylor Swift vlog. We are at Eras Tour in Nashville, baby. Take it away. Miss Eras, girl, I'm gonna let you do your thing. This is actually my third tour of the tour. Crazy. Show, show of the tour. Swifty, Taylor Swift fan. Swifty, Taylor Swift fan. Swifty, friend of a Swifty. That's how that works. I went to the first night in Glendale, the opening night of the tour, and then the second night in Glendale we spontaneously went to. So now I'm here in Nashville. Yeah, well, this, is, this is the original show that we got tickets for because this is our hometown, baby. I went with a like bejeweled, jewel-toned yeah. thing. I thought I had an outfit. And then I no, thought I had a backup outfit. she had outfit. a day. Well, I thought I had an outfit and then I thought I had the purple. Mm -hmm. Then I thought I had a backup, the flower. I, I'm on my period and things aren't going well for me. So, I have this dress that my mom got me. It's from ASOS, I think, right? I think Nasty Gal. Nasty Gal. It's from Nasty Gal and it's very cute. It's got like a heart on it and like a star. So I was like, that's Taylor enough. And with it being jewel tones, I was like, I'll just put some little bejeweled. I think she looks great. Moments. So, we are having a little. Yeah, okay. So, this is what's moment. going on. This is what's going on. Oh, I see Samantha. Where? Right there. Where? You can't see her. We are here at the stadium yes. because we were like, we're not sitting in. We'd rather sit in the parking lot for hours. She's wondering where we are. Hey, just, I just saw you. You just need to keep walking straight. Yeah, the blue car. Okay. Keep walking straight. Yeah, keep coming. Oh, I see her. I see you. I see Perfect. You. Okay. Bye. Anyway, we got here early so we didn't have to sit in traffic and Samantha and Samantha are about to join yes. us. And they have VIP so they've got early entry so and we were gonna like go to Broadway but we think that we're just gonna like hang out here. Hello! Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. They don't, they're not letting anybody in, but this old lady found us. She chased us. Wait, do you guys need more? And she came back and gave it to us. Oh my god, that looks incredible! She made that. Shut up. Beautiful. Oh, hi! Yeah, we are filming. Hi! We're my bedazzles. No, I have nothing to Okay. I won't shut up about the bedazzles. Your bedazzles? Oh, fun. Which one do you want? Whatever, just bedazzle the shit out of my hair. I have some unfortunate news. Look how much Andrew I have. Oh. So I don't know what I want to. I, I, I'm. I'm. I'm gonna be honest. I'm panicking. I wouldn't have seen it if you didn't say nothing. No, it's it's really it's really bad. bad. And I, there's it's it's so bad. Look at that. And it's everywhere. The thing is, I didn't wash my hair. I thought I was gonna be able to get away with it. I was in the shower when I made the decision mm -hmm. huh. not to wash my hair, so I didn't have the. My clothes didn't come. No. Yeah, and one of my feet's bigger than the other. Okay. So one of my shoes makes me feel like I'm about to be, my foot is gonna come off. Mm -hmm. So I have it off and unzipped. That's totally fine. <laughs> and none of my It's not showtime, fit. baby. It's not showtime yet. No, I'm I think, you know, the we'll just make it work. We will. We're getting bejeweled. Best believe I'm still bejeweled. Oh. oh. <laughs> It just feels it looks, like surgery. Like, yeah, it I looks just, like it. It never doesn't work. Try a different thing. You guys, that right there that column is where we were when we were in the hall of fame we had our banner was that size yeah so we know that it's a nine foot banner
So, uh, Phoebe, do you, do you want to come out and sing with me? That took it all out of me. I mean, that took. I mean, I'm 
a shell of human. I have nothing left to give. Not anything. I, ha I don't know where I'm even at. I'm, it's one of those times where your just like head feels interesting because the sound has been so loud. I'm looking for Sam. I yeah, want to get out I'm of looking here. for Sam. Sam and Sam. Every TikTok I've seen, and it, it's like two friends, and one of them is the one that fought the Ticketmaster War, and one of them is the one that t fought the traffic war. Mm -hmm. I am both. Thank you for I, that story. Will you tell it again? I fought them both. So. Just kidding. Does anyone remember what the hashtag is for the hairs? <laughs> Guys! No! What? Are you kidding? Are you kidding? No, ha like how did you I just continue the concert? Either. Like we were, like it was Look okay. At the somebody gave me. Wait, I love those. I don't think you've ever seen anything cuter, huh? What happened in there? That was crazy. That was crazy. Your poncho matches your glasses. I know. I have not been a human being. Get inside. Since. We've got a debut. Yeah. What are you doing? I thought that's what you were doing. Look, my face looks chill. <laughs> normal, but like, why does that? Look, the sun's gonna come out tomorrow. Is it? I don't even know what happened. <laughs> We're still recovering. I definitely I can't have with this. issues right now. But it's okay because Speak Now comes out July 7th. Speak Now July 7th. There. Also Anna's birthday. Woo! Thanks so much Thrive Market for sponsoring this video. I just received one of my favorite packages to get, which is from Thrive Market. Now you know me, a snack girly loves opening a box of groceries. Thrive Market is an online membership-based grocery store on a mission to make healthy living easy and affordable for everyone with guaranteed savings on every order. As a Thrive member, you do save on every single order of the highest quality, sustainable, and organic products. Annika and I are huge fans of brands like Annie's and Simple Meals, and we love that we can get them at such an affordable price on Thrive Market. You can also filter the catalog of products by diet, lifestyle, and product types. It truly does feel so good to be able to scroll through the website and know that all of these products are good for me. They also don't just offer snacks. There are plenty of items for your home, baby, and fur babies. I always like to either get Luna or the cats a treat when I order from Thrive Market. Thrive Market also guarantees that you will make back your $60 membership fee in savings or Thrive Market will credit you the difference. All orders over $49 do ship for free. Click the link in my description box below or go to thrivemarket.com forward slash Jenica and Annika to get 30% off of your order plus a free gift worth up to $60. That's thrivemarket.com forward slash Jenica and Annika to get 30% off of your first order and a free gift when you join Thrive Market today. Thanks so much Thrive Market for sponsoring this video. Hello you guys. Okay, we have a lot of catching up today, but for now, the important thing to know is that we are okay. Second, this is now Sunday. Concert was Friday, this is Sunday. You've not seen us since. And we've not been, uh, we've been a show of humans. We since. have been on the couch. Annika tried to get up and go get us breakfast yesterday. And <laughs> she's, she FaceTimed me and she had blood. When her sinuses, like when it's really, it's it's May now in Tennessee, so sinuses and flowers and pollen is everywhere. And her nose just like aggressively bleeds all the time. And so she immediately came back home and we watched Real Housewives of New York. All day. All, at least all six day. hours, at least six <laughs> hours. And then went to bed. We're back up today and you know when your mom and your daughter's favorite human being alive like above you is 20 minutes down the road you let your daughter kind of do what you want what she wants so we are we are back in downtown Nashville baby okay so we don't have tickets tonight or anything Speaking but of, we haven't chatted about this everyone's saying that the tickets drop drastically an hour after the show starts so, so we had actually already planned. We we thought about maybe doing it both nights, but we no, Nashville sure. has a pedestrian bridge because the stadium is right across a river from like downtown Nashville. And when they were building it in the early 2000s, they knew that it was like people were going to come to downtown before they went to the game, so they needed a way to get over there. So there's a bridge that's like literally only for pedestrians. So we had planned to maybe go and sit on the bridge because you could hear and there's like big screens. And we've been seeing the last two days that people, there have been like probably a thousand, I would say at least, at least, that are of people outside the stadium on the bridge. So we're definitely not gonna be alone. Um, but it's just fun to hear the music and the surprise songs. And like, we're gonna, we're gonna like sit down and debrief our actual thoughts because I have a lot of thoughts that I would like to say. But also just like truly like thoughts from a non-Swifty, like I'm, a Taylor Swift fan, not Swifty. Yeah, I'm but uh, it was—it's just an experience. Like it's not even a concert; it's an experience. Yeah. 
So, how fun. Just just hang along. We don't, we don't like really know what we're doing. Taylor weekend. Everything yeah. is Taylor based. Hopefully at some point we'll make our way to the Hall of Fame pop up of Taylor because exclusive merch and we know we're merch girlies, so. Also, look how cool, oh, can you see them? Not really. Oh, you can see them on your shirt. The little um, rainbow effect. Coming down like right here. How cute. From her, oh, there we go. Window stickers. I thought the clouds were cute here. So fun. One of our favorite restaurants in Nashville, and they took our tip of putting a hundred in the wine glasses. I like to sing. Oh yeah, it's very cute. The beats. I love that. Yes, that is so oh, cute. cute. Those would have been so cute with your shirt. Oh, oh cute. That's that so cute. That might be cute for like Coachella next year. We just got snow cones. Annika, what was your what was your school? Sour. Tart? Sour tart. Sour no. tart. What was it? Sweet tart. Something. Sweet tart. Sour. It's very sour. This is wedding cake with sweet cream on top. I love like snow cream. And look at our view. It's downtown Nashville, the Ryman, aka church, and boom, Batman building. Is it so sour? Oh. This is exactly what I wanted. get the title of Honorary Swifty <laughs> for attendance yeah. in the pouring rain, you guys. <laughs> it is pouring. <laughs> oh, we had to come get ponchos. I love Nashville. Look out! This is crazy! Ah! <laughs> oh, the things we do, the things we do. It's fun though, I don't regret it in the least bit. No, it's really fun. We got some merch for a gift, and we're walking back. We think we might like kind of sit in the car for a second, maybe park somewhere different. I think so. Woo! She's even gorgeous in the rain. How beautiful is the purple bridge, you guys? It's really, really coming down. Crazy, crazy. Everything that can be lit up in Nashville is lit up purple for Taylor. For some reason, I'm actually in a very chipper mood. Yeah, because this is actually fun at the end of the day. At the end of the day, it's Timbers. Yeah, it's Timbers. Yeah, look at that, look at that. <laughs> oh, y'all, y'all. That was crazy. Correct also, tourists. let me just show you, for real, for real. Like that is, it was a puddle. It was a swimming pool. I mean, I can't put those on for sure. For sure. Okay, I'm gonna go pee. And she said, but I got pee. Oh, this is gonna freak me out. Here, can you put all that stuff in the car? What? Can you put that stuff in the car? Yeah, for sure. We'll move layers. 
And look at this. Y'all, look how much water just came off of us, our jackets and stuff. This is where I worked when I worked downtown at Warby Parker. We were on the 8th and, or like we were on the what floor? I got six. Was, yeah, I think it was 6th, 7th, and 8th. We occupied three total floors in that building and when in 2016 when I got the job, they were telling me all the information over the phone and I was writing it down and I was like trying to be so engaging and just, you know, I just got an, uh, the job offer. So I had my little post-it and I grabbed a pen and he said it's at the... Oh, he's cute. <laughs> he's <just> cute. <laughs> And he said, it is at the LNC Tower. And I was like, perfect, awesome, great. I'll be there. I'll, I will be there. Don't you worry, I'll be early. So I hang up and I call everybody that I know. And I'm telling them that it's in the LNC Tower downtown. And I go to Google it just to see where, where might stop be. And it, I can't find anything for the LNC Tower. So I call my dad and I'm like, dad, it's at the LNC Tower, but I can't, like, where is that at? And he was like, what? And I said, the LNC Tower. And he was like, I don't know what that is, but there is an L and C tower. And I was like, oh, okay. There's no L and involved. Yeah. <laughs> I loved working there and I'm so glad that I worked there. And I have wanted to work at a building in downtown Nashville literally since I was like five years old. I told both my parents, I'm gonna do it. And it was lovely. Lovely. Good morning. How we doing, Weez? Are you still bejeweled? Good morning. Okay, Annika is at work. Obviously, we did not end up staying for the concert, and she did come on. So basically what happened is we kept, we, we just couldn't bring our phones and stuff out anymore because I was soaking wet. And even like once I got changed in the car, we were just, everything we had was wet. So we got home and we literally just like passed out. I think we ended up staying until like, what was it? Not too, too, too late. She did end up going on. So it still was a little bit delayed, but essentially what they did is they just didn't do the openers. So it wasn't too, too bad. Hopefully for the people that were there. I know that we were like jumping around having so much fun, but I think that we were having fun because at that hour specifically, because we didn't have any money invested into that concert. But those fans, those Swifties, they got a night. I mean, cause Guess what, I'll probably go to concerts at that stadium again, but there will never be a rain show singing Midnight with Taylor at midnight in the rain. Come on, that is so fun, that is so fun. I would have loved to stay and watch that show too, but we just, we had to come home. We were, we were tapped out. I do think I'll probably be a little tiny bit sick if Carrie, if my mom knew that I was outside with wet hair, wet shoes, and in the cold, I, I, she's probably still gonna call and ground me after this. <laughs> this, but we just, we had fun. We had fun and that is all that matters. I will say, because we were planning on like sitting down with you guys after we watched whatever night that we watched on the bridge and talking about Eris tour, but that didn't happen. And I can't end this vlog without saying, holy shit. Like I, how many times in this vlog did I say, I appreciate and love Taylor Swift. I don't feel like I put in enough work to be a Swifty. I don't know enough lyrics to be a Swifty. To be able to stand, like regardless of any opinions that you may have, like even if you are Taylor Swift's number one fan, just think about it like this. When I called Madison this morning, I said, I can't even t say that that was a concert because it was truly an experience. Like it was an experience to feel and see everything at that show because Fearless was released when I was 15 years old and it included the song 15. I literally start crying. You know, I'm just coming off my period. So it's, I'm emotional. Okay. But I like scream saying those lyrics in my car as a 16 year old, like experiencing all of those lyrics. And, and then Fearless Taylor's version was released when Annika was 15. And then to see her experience those same lyrics in like such a different way. But like me also wanting her to hear the message that I was telling myself, like you are more than the boy you date on the football team. Oh, I don't know why this makes me so emotional. Experiencing Taylor Swift as a mom is totally different is what I'm trying to say. Because like I feel so many of her lyrics for me and and I use them to get through situations for me. But then for Annika to also, and even more, I mean, Annika like 
breathes Taylor Swift. So what better freaking role model? What better person for, you know, your daughter to look up to than someone you took your advice from yourself, you know? God, this is crazy that I'm crying like this. I think I get to call myself a Swifty now, huh? Okay, maybe I'm just tired and delirious at this point too. And a little sick. Okay, okay, but I say all this to say, when Annika and Samantha Joe were in Arizona and went night one and they called me and said they were going again, I, just, I didn't get it. And then I was like, is she still even wanna, gonna wanna go in Nashville? Like, and she was like, no mom, you don't understand. I'm even more excited about this one. I didn't understand the multiple shows thing. I would go right now again to Eras Tour. I would go right now. Annika was like, I'm looking up the prices in the New York one. And I'm like, no, we can't. No, no, no. But I looked at Annika and I was like, well now how do you feel now that you've like experienced, you've experience your last third and final Eras Tour show and she was like it might not be the last one and I was like it is the last one <laughs> unless we get to go for free <laughs> it's the last one truly though if you love Taylor Swift and you did, weren't able to get tickets it was just as fun being around that many that many Swifties like we there was just so much to do around the stadium too and so many ways to get involved it was just a really really fun time okay this is I, I got I have got to I'm gonna go and cuddle Weasley some more. Weasley, you would definitely be friends with Olivia and Meredith, wouldn't you? Okay, goodbye you guys. I love you so much. And truly, you know that I can't even tell you what I went through in order to get the Taylor Swift tickets for Annika back in 2014. To continue having these experiences with my daughter is just something I will never be able to thank you guys enough to for allowing us to do, but also getting to experience these things with us now. I love you guys so much, and thank you for watching. Bye. Can you tell them bye? You gotta do this since I just.